Hey all you cellists or cellistas out there, Jacob here, and I hope you're all having an awesome day wherever you are. So imagine the following scene. You're in a session with a singer-songwriter, composer, or music producer, and you've been brought in to add some special magic to a given track, as we cellists so often are. But after you're given the rough outline or chart of what you're about to be improvising on, you're told that they'd like this performance to have a Spanish or flamenco feel. Or maybe they want the main lick to have a sort of Indian raga type style. Or what about wanting you to sound like a country fiddler, a rock guitarist, or even a soundtrack that needs a Gregorian chant or even Renaissance type feel to it. And while it's virtually impossible for any cellist, or any musician really for that matter, to live up to the business card billing of multi-style and really be fluent in several genres, I've really come to believe that it's critical for all multi-style, creative, whatever you want to call it, cellists, to have at least a small sliver of each of these styles in their musical tool belt. And it's also a lot of fun. We're going to be launching a new series on the Improviser's Guide entitled Three Fake Licks. Rather than focusing on the macro elements of these diverse musical styles, which obviously can and does take a lifetime in, unto itself to master, we'll be drilling down on three licks which encapsulate the basic time, tone, and ornamental techniques from a master cellist practitioner of that. That style. These fun, fast-paced, and inspiring videos will give you the ability to whip out a few exciting ideas in your session and can also serve as a foundation for new tricks that you incorporate into the styles that you're passionate about. And you can check out the first installment of our series, Three Fake Indian Licks, with Carnatic cellist Jake Sharkey. And as I said, for me, having a toe in many of these different styles over the course of my life has opened up a tremendous amount of doors for me. And I hope it will for you as well. Hope to see you there.